This one AI tool helps me create seven pieces of viral content in under 30 minutes without using ChatGPT or an overly complicated tool. And it is the AI tool that's helped me scale my agency's output and helped me hit 10, 15, and $20,000 per month. I've also spoken about this on Forbes articles, podcasts, and even some private events. Now, this is not going to be one of those video tutorials where I tell you to use a generic two page long prompt and just run with it, or even try and plug you an AI prompting course. But to show you that you can write near expert level content in seconds that helps you grow thousands of followers, build your personal brand, and can potentially make you six figures online. This tool changed the game for me and I can't believe no one's talking about it yet. So my friends, the secret AI tool is called Microsoft Copilot. And here's exactly how you can use it in five simple steps. Step number one is download Microsoft Edge onto your computer. And then once it's open, select the blue icon on the top right corner. Then step number two is open Copilot and then select more creative. This is where the magic happens because it leverages all the power of GPT-4, which is basically steroids for creative writing. The third step, and listen to me carefully, is to find viral content on Twitter that we can use as inspiration. You can use tools like Twimex to help you identify top performing posts quickly, or as a gift from me, I'm going to leave a link in the description to my viral Twitter swipe file that I use every single day to write content online. Now I'm relying on Twitter the most because the platform has millions of pre-validated pieces of content in every single single industry. So whether you're writing on LinkedIn, Facebook, Instagram, or even scripting for YouTube, using Twitter is an unfair advantage. They've got the proven frameworks, the proven hooks, and the proven ideas. All we have to do is be inspired by them or use GPT-4 to do it for us. Step number four is start prompting Bing. Now, the first thing you want to do is pull up a viral tweet and have it open on Copilot, then click on more creative, and then we insert the first prompt, which is analyze this and give me 10 similar viral hooks ideas. Then once it gives you the hooks, analyze them and choose the one that you like the most. The thing that I love the most about Copilot over ChatGPT, Perplexity, or even anything else is that the hooks are specific to be actually useful. ChatGPT doesn't do that that well from just one prompt, but Copilot does. Now for a second prompt, and this really does help me to give away, but I'm done gatekeeping, so here you go. Use this wisely. Please finish writing this post with the style and tone of voice of non-creator. Keep each sentence eight to 10 words max and add a space after each period. Keep the overall post on the 30 lines each here's a hook and now all you have to do is add one creator that you really like a ton of voice off and then the hook that you chose that bing ai generated for you how i got 10 times more leads from linkedin with these simple tricks that's the hook that we're going to use and then as known creator i'm going to use justin welsh the reason why i'm using justin welsh and for those who don't know him he's a very big creator on twitter there's a lot more data to collect from him he's got a lot more content than anyone else and his tone of voice is pretty specific educational and high level content and he's got that so so hence why I'm using him as an example instead of Alex Hosmosi, which is different. This literally gives you a near expert level first draft. It's it's insane. You can tweak it, play around with different topic suggestions, go back to rewriting the hook and, you know, change the tone of voice. It's up to you. But what I can't argue is that this is better than any chat GPT prompt I've ever seen for LinkedIn content or any type of written content ever. Then I take the first draft and add in or take away elements as to the style and vibe of whoever I'm writing for or even myself. And lastly, step number five is to make the use of AI undetectable. So here's a quick writing masterclass so you sound like a pro even with AI. Step number one is, use simple words, not complex. AI tends to use about fifth grade level words, remove them. For example, don't use synergies, use efforts or teamwork. The simpler your content is to understand, the better. LinkedIn may be a professional platform, but it's still social media. Step number two is to add descriptive and emotional words. Instead of going on a long tangent that takes paragraphs worth of your posts, use key descriptive words that make it easy to imply what the rest of the context is. Instead of saying, my boss made me feel so burnt out, it caused problems at home, leading me to gain weight, break up with my boyfriend and leave my dog at home. Say, I was burnt out, gain weight and lost my dog. Same thing, shorter reading time. I mentioned this on the prompt for a reason. And in particular here, we're optimizing for mobile. The majority of users on LinkedIn at least read content on mobile. So it's key for us to make the post fit the screen. And it's also important to note that the easier you make it for the reader to skim, the more likely they are to come back. You're catching their attention in a very short period of time and thus gaining their trust and their interest and keeping their attention as well. Taking your written content from just another post to the post. Fourth is to write 
quite like you're explaining to a friend. The problem when prompting for content creation on ChatGPT or even Copilot here is that they naturally start talking like a salesperson. It then writes intrusive, pushy and cringy content that you'd never actually post on your personal account. And even if you speak at the most professional events, you wouldn't actually say rocket emoji, maximize your productivity, a guide to making every hour count, rocket emoji. Let's learn from each other and elevate our productivity together. Hashtag Pomodoro technique, hashtag habit stacking, hashtag professional development. You wouldn't say that. You'd add your own mannerisms, use simpler words too, and even less as well. Treat your content like you're on a FaceTime call with a friend. Make the topic super interesting. Don't use any fancy or overly complicated vocab. Simplify it so they get it. And lastly, but the most important one, write like you talk, be yourself. And listen, AI will never replace you, but it will definitely save you time. And that's literally it, kings and queens. This is exactly how you can use AI to grow your personal brand fast. Try this out, save yourself some time and start dominating your industry. Please let me know how these go for you and I hope you love these prompts as much as I do. And if someone at Microsoft is watching this, hi, I'm a big fan. <laughs> Bye.